Oh, there he is. All right, he's just running outside, finally. Hello and good morning. Yes, I just didn't really feel ready this morning. I did not struggle waking up on time. This time actually, I was able to get up from about 10 minutes early today, so I was spot on. However, I had a feeling that I have already grown out of school. I kind of had enough already. But it is the last week before we go on break. Last week, though, was a pretty busy week, except for Friday. On Monday, we heard that Lily fell from three stories above the ground, broke her leg. On Tuesday, we did a geography project, and then ladies' night versus gents' night, gentlemen's night. Wednesday was that day I had it rough. I had manicure, pedicure, 6 p.m. video chat and girl scan episode all together at the same time. Thursday was the wedding day. On Saturday, we attended my cousin's birthday party. And yesterday, Sunday, we got Smokey in the house. Anyways, so guys, I don't take the bus anymore. I already told you the other day. It is 7.57 and my driver should be coming momentarily, very soon. Yes, if I was to be taking the bus, then that wouldn't be 7.57. That would be like 7.35, 7.40, something, some time of day. So, I'm about 15 minutes off here this time. So, today's weather is cloudy. Yesterday, we somewhat got some sunshine in the morning before it reverted to rain again. And, yeah, today is that day I go to MacFit again. And the fact that they have changed the name, let's see what it's gonna be like. I'm just gonna get in there and I'm gonna speak to the reception ladies and we'll see what happens. It should be easy though. It should be easy as it was in the past. As I have experienced going to MacFit before, I can hear some car engine. That's for sure my driver coming. Well, the roads are slippery due to the rain over the past two days, so. He might be struggling. It is 8 to 4 and my driver's still not here. He told me that he's gonna be late. And I'm like, what the fuck? Like, there's no traffic. Look. Look, no traffic. Almost nobody coming. And I just don't know what's the big excuse. I mean, like, normally I would wait if there's, like, any kind of traffic coming. Like, it almost always happens in the morning when cars pass by today. It's just one of those days of exception. No one is coming, and my driver said he's gonna be a bit late. I don't know why that is. Like, I'll talk to him, and he'll give me a straight answer anyway. I just didn't know why. It's just that, you know, it's parent-teacher conference week, and there's no traffic at all. I live inside my own world of make-believe Kids screaming in the cradles, profanities I see the world through ice covered in pink and bleach Cross out the ones who heard my cries and watch me weep I love everything Fire spreading all around my room My world's so bright It's hard to breathe But that's alright It was kind of tough this morning I got to school, it was 8.58 And when my driver came It was 8.18 And I got in the car I asked him, hey what the heck After 15 minutes of waiting outside Like there wasn't an excuse For him to be that late he got out of his house and on the highway there was a heavy traffic jam. It was awful. It was like locked. And when we got on to that, that part of the road that would get close to my dad's house, that's pretty much the same. All traffic, all locked, all congested. So we had to take a different road and that's what brought us late to school. Some people just don't even focus well enough, unfortunately. But yes, there was a hefty traffic jam at one area that it was raining really hard as well. We also had some rain at this location, but until about 6.45 a.m. over there, where Kubidai was driving, which is my driver, he, over there it was continuing to rain really hard at 7.45, and it was a locked area. It was locked, full of cars, full of motorbikes, 
full of buses, full of honking drivers. It was just locked. Yeah, it was much more like this, you know, pattern that we had last year. It was around November, December of last year that when I would get on the bus, here's the thing, here's how it goes. One day we would come to school pretty early when the class isn't fully occupied yet, but the next day they just waste our time, we get pretty late and we had to write our names down when we enter the school if we come any later than 9 a.m. Like that's just a waste of time. Like one day early, one day late, like a polynomial. But this was just a major exception due to a hefty traffic jam on the biggest highways we have in town. All right, I got in there and I'm gonna start. Jesus, this is so much different. Yep, I just got in the fitness center. I had a talk with the ladies at the reception and I would like to make it, let's make it eight. This is gonna be a 10 minute run at the speed of eight. My first time back here after months is gonna be a 10 minute run at the speed of eight. It's funny that they, they still have this virtual world travel throughout and right now I'm going around the forest it's nice, I really like it. Nine minutes and 48 seconds on that treadmill, about nine seconds to go. Look, I'm right up this mountain now, according to my virtual tour. Two seconds, one, and finished. It's been 10 minutes, finish. There, there we go. 10 minutes and one second, 1.32 kilometers and 110 calories. Time to start this. This is now the jogging machine. Let's stop. What the heck? I had it pretty solid this evening. I did a 10 minute run on the treadmill, then a 10 minute jog with the jogging machine. And I have been spending two minutes lifting 40 weights. Now I'm gonna go into that room that there are plenty of bikes and outside there, there is somebody playing basketball. So yes, I came in there it went pretty easy. I had a very short discussion with the ladies at the reception. They just wanted to check out my phone to confirm well enough that I am actually signed in to this club. And I mean, I tried to show them the application, but it didn't work, but it was just easy. So they just slided to let me in there. So there we go. Now I'm going to go out of there. Yep, basketball even though just one person, still. Let's see how it does. Let's just watch him for a few seconds. There we go. Yes, he did it. Lucky. All right, let's go into that room where all the bikes are. Yes, now guys, I have moved to where all the bikes are. One more person has moved to the basketball place. Last time I checked, I had done 9,293 steps throughout the day. Practically a lot more than yesterday including my tennis lesson that I had, the number of steps yesterday I took was 6,935. Yeah, that's practically a lot more work than what I, just what I did yesterday. Easy to say that. And today I came into school not motivated enough. Like, you know, it's parent-teacher conference week and I just ran to school really late, ruining my motivation. Well though, how about if we sprint on that bike, right? Ah, there we go. RPM has gone up to 104, it was at 81. There we go. Yep, it closed, there we go. This is level three, I put it down to zero. Yep, I'm done for today. It was pretty nice. I took it around the time I would normally do, even though it's my first time back after seven months. Yep, Look what there we I'm go, Smokey is look, look. Hey, uh, oh. yeah smokey, get. smokey. Get there you go fetch get. Get. is he gonna get it yeah wait yeah okay smokey get. smokey smokey hello <laughs> <laughs> yeah okay Good. i mean yeah he's just getting used to the house so i guess but uh, he played with it today oh he played with it excellent yeah. well efforts smokey i got an idea for you Hey, no, don't. Ah, look who I got. Yeah. <laughs> yeah.
He's too little for that anyway. Once he gets to the size of, close to the size of SJF and Lily, then it will be more appropriate. I have made it a pretty easy day at the gym. For the first phase of returning, I have done a 10 minute run on the treadmill at the speed of eight. Uh, Smokey? Smokey? Smokey, you're here. Wait. Okay, guys. Ah. Uh, Jeez. I thought that Smokey was inside the room, but he's just outside. Hold on a second, guys. Just one minute. I'll be back. Hey, Smokey. Hey, Smokey. I knew that was you. I knew you went all up there. Hey. No, no, no. Where are you going? Where are you going? Wow, he's coming in. He's coming in. He's, he's discovering my studying room for the first time. The cable. Smokey, what are you? Okay, get out. No, 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 Smokey, no. Cable. Smokey, no biting the cables. Oh, there he is. All right, he's just running outside, finally. Excuse me, guys, I just got a bit too distracted that Smokey was meowing right in front of the door. He just wanted to explore around this room. Anyways, I would like to go back to what I was just talking about. So 10 minutes of running on the treadmill at the speed of eight, 10 minutes of using a jogging machine and five minutes on the bike and lifting some weights additionally, other than using any of the equipment. I have tried lifting the eight kilogram lifts 15 times and the five kilogram weights about 40 times. So it shouldn't make a big difference. So on Thursday, I'm gonna go back to the fitness and I am gonna, I'll do a bit longer on the treadmill. Doesn't matter if I do speed eight again or if I make a nine this time or like I do time to time, one minute run, one minute walk. Like just one minute rest after a free tire and walk like you do in a marathon. Yep, that's still smoky, guys. So today was just about the first day that we had the first full day with Smokey. At some part of yesterday, we didn't even have him yet. So today was the first day. Yesterday, while we were having dinner, he was crying and not even used to it. He cried because number one, he's not even anywhere near being used to this house. And number two, he just misses Katy and the rest of the family, including his brothers, his sisters, his siblings, and back Kai and Shayla's house, so he'll get used to it and all that. Wish him the luck. And tomorrow's vlog is going to be fully outdoors, so I will see you. That is it. I will see you in tomorrow's video. Like and subscribe and have a good day.